In this video, I'm going to show you how to subtract fractions that have the same denominator. The steps of doing so are very easy. First, subtract your numerators. Second, keep your denominator the same. And then last, simplify if needed. Let's take a look at our first example. What is 4 sevenths minus 1 seventh? Well, step one is going to be subtract numerators. So 4 minus 1 is going to equal to 3. And we're going to keep 7 the same. So 3 sevenths is our answer. Now, in order to simplify this, we'd have to find a common factor between 3 and 7. And the only factors of 3 and 7 are 1 and 3 and 1 and 7. So this one is in its lowest form already. If you'd like some help on simplifying fractions, I have a video I've created. I'll leave a link to that video in the description below. Number two, what is 5 eighths minus 2 eighths? Step one, we subtract our numerators. 5 minus 2 is 3. Second step, keep your denominator the same. So 3 eighths is our answer. Do 3 and 8 share a common factor between the two of them? The answer is no. So 3 eighths is in simplest form. Question three, what is 8 ninths minus 2 ninths? Step one, 8 minus 2 is 6. Keep our denominator of 9 the same. So the answer is 6 over 9. Are there any numbers that are common factors between 6 and 9? Well, if you said 3, then you're correct. So what we're going to do is we're going to take 6 divided by 3. It's going to equal 2. And 9 divided by 3 is going to equal 3. So 8 ninths minus 2 ninths is, in its simplest form, 2 thirds. Last example, 5 6 minus 1 6. Step 1, 5 minus 1 is 4. Keep our denominator 6 the same, and we have 4 6. What's a common factor? Well, 2 goes into both of them. So let's divide 4 by 2 and 6 by 2. And again, we get two-thirds. So now that you've been through four examples together, see if you can try this one on your own. What is 11 twelfths minus 3 twelfths? Drop me your answer below and make sure you put it in your simplest form. Good luck! If you want to see more math help videos, hit that subscribe button and the bell for notifications. If there's a topic you want to see a video on, drop me a comment below. Check out improvemath.com for free printable worksheets, and as always, thanks for watching.